Ablis is the owner of a condiment processing plant in Xinjiang. He was originally an executive in a large company. In 2012, a friend's tomato sauce processing plant was going out of business. Time for Ablis to step up and step in. After investing in the plant, the first thing Ablis did was to reposition the product. He developed a tomato sauce with a darker color and stronger taste to meet the preferences of Xinjiang people. Every processing plant's most closely guarded secret is the recipe. Just when Nablis was getting complacent about the unique taste of his sauce, he suddenly found that there was no sales channel for it. Ablis negotiated with one supermarket after another. To get closer to the owners, he offered to help sort the shelves and clean the store. He also proposed to supply products free of charge. He'd only collect payment on product actually sold. This is a supermarket under Ablis's direct management. It's long been his habit to communicate directly with sales staff in order to understand market dynamics. After more than 10 years of effort, he now has over 1,000 outlets like this one and his tomato sauce products occupy 40% of the market share in Xinjiang. After establishing himself in the Xinjiang market, Ablis set his sights on the international market. The China Eurasia Expo, held annually in Urumqi, the capital of Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region, opened up a new world for him. In 2019, during his first participation in the expo, Ablis signed orders worth nearly 10 million yuan with a few Asian countries. <laughs> 